Oh. It's you again. I didn't expect you to come back to this side of town. You really are a dummy after all. Well, what are you doing out here? What? What? Oh my gosh, you really are stupid. Why would you come looking for me? <laughs> We're not friends. I don't know where you got that idea. We're just people who happen to know each other. That's all it is, okay? <laughs> me drinking your blood doesn't make us bonded or anything. Man, you humans get some weird ideas in your head. There's nothing romantic about b drinking each other's blood. That's a myth. I don't think you know anything about real vampirism. Do you? I didn't think so. Huh? You want me to teach you more? Uh, that sounds like a pain. Fine, I guess I can teach you a little bit about being a vampire, but... I'm not doing this because I like you or anything. Okay? Okay. Well... What kind of stuff do you want to know about, anyway? Yeah. We have to drink blood to live. We can eat human food, too, though. It just... isn't as important, I guess. We have to drink blood in order to survive, because it has things in it we need. Vampire biology is hard to explain like that, okay? <laughs> no. I don't sleep in a coffin. That was made up. Humans thought since we were creepy or whatever that we would sleep in coffins. They also think we're dead. And that's a lie too. Vampires aren't, like, undead or anything. We're just different biologically. Well, I don't know. I'm not an expert or anything. I mean, I guess that's a pretty good question. Maybe. Where vampires originally came from isn't a really well-recorded thing. I mean, our history as a species has been somewhat lost. The records of it were destroyed, partially at least, in different raids and things. But you know, we go way back. I mean, my ancestors were probably some of the toughest vampires ever. And a lot of them were burned. Well, don't hold that against you. It was your ancestors that did all that. You seem to be a fairly decent modern human, I suppose. Maybe. You better watch yourself, though. And even if you're fairly decent, you're still stupid. You came wandering back here into vampire territory after I went through all the trouble of walking you home. Well, speaking of that, did you figure out exactly who you are? Your brain was pretty much scrambled last time we spoke. You're still putting that together, huh? You're probably a hopeless case. Hmm? My clothes? It's my school uniform, dummy. Uh, I'm a high school student. How old do you think I am? You humans are so weird. Well, yeah, I mean, vampires have longer lifespans than humans. But I'm still a fairly young vampire, alright? I'm still well within the range of time where I can choose to go to high school. Yeah, because we have long lifespans, we can afford to waste a whole lot of time before we get an education like that. If we have other more important things to do. And I do. In case you forgot, I have some territory to oversee. Wouldn't be surprised if you forgot that. You're an amnesiac, after all. Okay, fine. I won't make fun of you for it. Whatever. 
guess it's not your fault. Maybe. We don't really know, do we? Yeah, I go to a school not far from here. It's mostly humans there, but there's plenty of vampires that go to the school. No one knows about it. Well, me and most of the others go there just to keep an eye on things. Relations between humans and vampires. Yeah, well, I don't know how much I should really tell you, but since you'll probably just forget it all anyway, I guess I'll just tell you what I do. I keep an eye on things at that school, so I can help ease vampires back into human society. Years ago, way, way, way long before you were born, or your mother, or your grandmother probably, vampires and humans all lived in the same territory. They coexisted, and most people didn't know which people were vampires and which weren't. Unless they knew them well. Of course, some humans fell prey to vampires that kind of abused things. Hmm? Oh, well. Vampires like me follow a certain set of rules. We only take blood from humans who willingly offer it. And we never attack humans unless it's completely necessary for defense. Well, yeah, there's been plenty of vampires throughout history that didn't adhere, adhere to these rules at all. They just took blood from people all willy-nilly or whatever. I'm not going to do that to you. I got your permission last time, remember? Yeah. That's what I thought. Actually, I am a little surprised you remembered. Well, okay, I guess your amnesia might not extend to everything. Back to my point, though. I'm overseeing the effort to transition the younger generation of vampires into human society. And we're doing that through the high school. It's a pretty prominent high school. It's not the biggest in the area. There's another one larger. Well, I'm glad I'm not in that one. Apparently a lot of weird stuff has happened there recently. Yeah. <sighs> anyway, you said you came all this way to see me. Why? Huh? Why are you saying that weird sappy stuff out of nowhere? You wanted to see me again? You couldn't get me out of your head? You realize how dumb that sounds, right? <laughs> Whatever. I guess you can stay with me on my walk to school, but... No longer than that. I don't want to have to explain who you are to people, especially when you don't even know who you are yourself. You dummy. <sighs> Come on. Is there anything else you wanted to know about vampires? Since we have a little time. Yeah, I already said that we are pretty old compared to humans. I guess it has to do with that biology thing again. We just last longer or something. But only if we drink blood. Yeah, the easiest way to kill a vampire, I think, is to deprive them of blood. Uh, don't tell anyone I told you that, though. I don't need anyone using weaknesses against us. <laughs> Yeah, I don't think you're smart enough to be a spy. Well, that's not mean. It's just the truth. Baka. Well. Anyway, any other questions? <laughs> no, we can't turn into bats. <laughs> you humans come up with the silliest, dumbest things in the world. Oh my goodness. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. We're coming up on my school. I guess I'll see you around. We don't stay in this area too long. I mean, there's some real creeps around. Remember how I told you how some vampires don't adhere to our rules like they should? Well, that's not just in the past, you know. 
There's a lot of weirdos around. Yeah. Look, just... Hmm. Just only come around this area around the time of the day you did today. If you have to at all. I mean, it's not like I want to see you again or anything. I'd be just fine if you never came back. But if you're going to be stupid and come back, then I guess just do it carefully. Whatever. See you around, Baka.